Hi, this is Brian Van from Sport Bike Track Year, sportbiketrackyear.com. I'm going to do a video review today of the Arai Vector helmet for you. Arai has a pretty broad line. Okay, we've got from the big gun the Arai RX7 Corsair all the way down to the Vector full face. Okay, each one of them is different and unique in its own way. Uh, specifically this time we're going to focus on the Vector. I've weighed this helmet on the scale. In a size medium it comes in at 3.45 pounds. That's the same weight as a medium RX-7 Corsair. They're able to keep the weight down with a complex laminate construction shell, okay, and they also use a multi-density EPS in the helmet. The multi-density EPS is going to work to protect you in the event of a fall. The EPS is, is really the critical part. It absorbs the energy when you have an accident. Let's give you a good 360 of this helmet. We'll talk a little bit more about it. Let's start with ventilation. Arai uses a multi-position chin vent. This does a couple of different things. One, it can direct air onto the face of the rider, okay, to keep you cool. Two, you can put it in the other position and it directs air up onto the shield to help clear fogging. It's a nice feature. We've got vents up here in the brow on this helmet, okay. The reason they chose to put those in the shield and not put any holes in top of the shell is because when you put a hole in the shell, you're drilling through the EPS. This is a very critical area here in the forehead. When you put holes in the EPS, it lessens the helmet's ability to protect you in the event of a fall. Excellent feature. You've got a large volume vent on the top of the helmet here. It's got a nice multiple detent system to open and close it. Love the quality of the vent. Each one of the detents is good and positive. All the awry quality. The back of the helmet. We've got our exhaust vent back here. Once again, it's multi-position. We've got holes here, here, and here. They put some pretty good sized knobs on here. Okay. The reason they did that is so you can do this with your gloves on. The ones that you can do with your gloves on are going to be the chin, the one on the top of the helmet, and the exhaust vent. I would suggest doing these when your gloves are off, the ones on the shield. They're just a little bit lighter duty, if you would, than the rest of the vents, and they're a little harder to feel with your gloves. So decide whether or not you want these open or closed before you put your gloves on. Just going to help you keep everything in one piece. Let's talk about the shield from Arai. It has a couple of different features built in. One, it's got a locking tab all the way at the very bottom. Stay secure. It cannot come open. That's excellent. You can pop it open just a little bit. If there's fog conditions out there, by popping it open just a little bit, it helps to bring shield. If some air onto the shield, keeps the fogging clear. Good thing. Now, for the helmet shield removal and installation. A lot of people out there think the Arai shields are difficult to remove and replace. I disagree with that. I really think this may be the very best helmet shield mechanism on the market. I'm going to show you why I feel that way right now. You're going to see here it might be hard to pick up because of the coloration of this helmet, but we've got basically just a little tab here. It's got a little arrow on it. You need to pull it up. Okay, there's one on both sides. I'm going to grab both of those now with my index finger. I'm going to pull them both up at the same time. You can feel them release. They're both pulled all the way up basically against the shield at this point. Grab the shield like so, dead center in the top, and just pull it right off. Don't hesitate. Don't go, oh, you know, I'm afraid I'm going to break the helmet. No. If you have them both released, pull the shield off. Now to put it back on, it's just as easy. You'll see right here where I'm putting my finger through, we've got a clear cutout in the helmet shield, okay? That goes into a pivot that's just underneath the side plate here. One side at a time, dip the shield in, push back, you can feel that slide right in there. Very positive engagement. Same thing on the other side, just simply repeat. Push it in, got it locked in, they're both in, they're good, grab the shield, push it down, you're done, okay? really that hard. Show me a better helmet shield mechanism. Okay. Let's talk about the liner of the helmet. On the vector, you can't remove the neck roll or the top pad. You can remove the cheek pads, you can wash the cover, you can replace the cheek pads to tune the fit of the helmet just a little bit. Let's talk about fit of this helmet. This fit, to me, is very, very similar to that of the RX-7 Corsair. The RX-7 Corsair is going to fit almost everyone out there very comfortably. 
When I say very comfortable, I mean probably the most comfortable helmet on the market. I feel this is right on par with the RX-7, and that's beautiful because this helmet sells for a whole heck of a lot less than the RX-7 Corsair does. I'm going to show you how to pull the cheek pads out right now. It's really very simple. Just kind of reach in here, just kind of pull forward just a little bit. It's going to pop right out like so. Best way to grab it is right at the back. It slides right out. Now you're going to see here the neck roll slides into there. Okay. All you got to do is slide the tab from the neck roll out just like that. The neck roll has a little locator tab that needs to slide into this pocket when you put it back in. Pretty simple to do. You can see it's right here on the end of the neck roll. What you need to do when you put it back together is quite simply, I like to take the cheek pad, distort it like so, slide the tab under. We're good there. Now we're going to grab our helmet strap, push that through like so. Take the front of the cheek pad and you need to lock that in place first. It's got a big locating tab, very easy to do, it slides right into the channel and then push in on the back portion of the cheek pad EPS. It goes right in. Show you the other side just as well. Just reach in there, give it a tug, comes right out, pull the part for the neck roll out of the cheek pad, just like that. One of the secrets to the Arai comfort and fit is the design of the cheek pad. I'm going to pull the cover off for you and show you that. It uses multiple density foam here. We've got our EPS, that's the part that protects you, the crumple zone if you will. And we have one layer of foam here and then a second softer layer of foam here. When you wash your cheek pads, I feel it's best to just take the cover off, cover off and wash that separately. You can get this wet as well if you want to. It takes a little bit longer for that to dry than it does just the outer cover. Slide that back over, like so, piece of cake, helmet strap back through. The price point this helmet operates at is excellent. Um, you know, and of course we've, we've got our sales here on Arai all the time. The best way to take advantage of that is, is simply email us at Arai at SportBikeTrackGear.com. Um, we can get right back with you. It's pretty much an instantaneous response. Or you can give my guys a call in the shop at 1-888-784-4327. We're going to put this cheek pad back in, locate the front of it, push in at the back, good positive engagement, you're done. For a, for a helmet that sells essentially for just over $400, uh, I don't think you're going to find anything better in the market. It ventilates above average for sure. Its comfort level is right there with the best of the best. If you don't feel that you're in a position to step up, you don't want to spend the money on the big dog, the RX-7 Corsair, this is a fantastic option. Okay, Save a ton of money and basically at the end of the day you're getting a helmet that's very, very close to their best offering. The Arai Vector Series is available in solids and graphics. Excellent choice. We're giving this baby two thumbs up. We'd give it three, but I've only got two hands.